Okay, welcome back to Dark Soul Gaming and Timberborn. Yes, we are back with our beavers, continuing to build our beaver colony. All right, we're going to get straight into it because we've just started the next day from where we left off in the previous episode, and we're straight away going into a drought in three days' time. So I really want to get this guy over here started now. Overnight, we've had 10 of our beavers grow up, and so well, now we've got nine. So I can actually get some beavers over here. So I'm going to do that right now. So the process for doing that is we're going to click on the district here, I'm going to press on migrate population and then I can choose which district. So either district two or district three. So district three is this one here or district two is the one over here we're not going to use yet. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to say I want to have nine adults. Press the migrate button and then what will happen is I will have nine beavers migrate over here and they'll make this their home. And here they are. See? So they're straight away going to use the stocks that are in our drop-off point. They're going to prioritize the building of the, the two water storage units here that I've prioritized. And then they're going to start getting stuck into this building over here because it's there to be done. So hopefully before the drought comes, we should be able to at least block off some of this water and get a bit more water supplied behind us. And that'll be great. Depends on how much we get in the way of deliveries, uh, logs, planks. Uh, no, we'd, we'd probably do okay. Logs is probably going to hurt us. We'll have to wait and see how many logs we get. Uh, the water is, um, well, first water storage is there, which is good. So they may start putting some water into there. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put four guys into there to help with moving stuff around. And uh, they're chopping some wood down locally. So that's going to help with this over here. All right. I just have to make sure they're not going to run out of food or water over here. That's the important part. Uh, what do they got? They got 70 water there. So they're okay. All right, so while they're beavering off with that, uh, get it? Um, we're, we're coming back over here. We're going to look at, see what we're doing over here. Uh, that's finished there. That's all done there. How are we going over here? So nothing has happened over here as yet, because I think, uh, yes, yeah, so they're not saying they're out of reach. I think they may be. We're just going to leave it. I, I, it's not essential that we go over there at the moment. I, I think, the essential part is to get this built and then we can get that built, stock some water up behind us and then get some metal so we can build some explosives and really start uh, making a bit of a difference. I do love it. Look, so we've got most of the bottom level of the dam is built and see how the water starts banking up and see it, it makes changes to the water flow. I think that is excellent. It's very simplistic, but it's actually the fluid dynamics in it is actually very good. You see now the water up behind it is building up. And there we go, it's breached the top of the, the dam there, so it's letting it go again. And it'll build back up a little bit more and then it'll breach. But that's um that's excellent. So right, so now they've built that level up there, and now look at this. It's starting to green because the water's coming up a higher level, so the moisture gets closer to the le the, the topsoil. So well, that's good. Right, what we don't want to do though is cause a flood down through here. And that's what these guys here are for. Okay, can't get all the required materials, that's okay. And there we go, so that one there is full, so what we've got left in here. So they're, they're doing their job, which is excellent. So they've got food, they've got water, they've got wood. So uh, they're happy little beavers. All right, and we've got one day till the drought. Um, so we're not going to get this built, I don't think, in any way, shape or form. I wouldn't care if we didn't get the top level done, just if we get the bottom level done with these um, floodgates, that would be great because then I can stop the flow and then when this dries out down the bottom part of the river below the dam, then we can actually let some water go and, and get that flowing and fill up with water. Right, so as you can see here, it's built up because the flow has been restricted, it's starting to build up back here. And this is why we need this dam in here done as well because we don't want the water to come through here because if it comes through here, it's going to come down through here and flood all this out. Right, so in fact, damming this up might actually cause us a problem at the moment. We'll see. We'll let it, we'll let it go and then if it's a problem, we can always remove it. Oh, that's good you're building that first. We're not a bad thing if you're doing that. I can't get to there. All right. Why can't you get into there? Hmm. It's interesting. I don't know why you can't get to there. 
Hmm. Why? Why is that so? I think normally I've had them get to this area without too much of an issue. A path in there, see that makes a difference. Sometimes the pathing just can be a little awry and it won't do it, but we'll just see. All right, the drought's coming in, so it's not going to help us at that point. The other option, what we can do is we can pull it back a bit um, and do it on this side, uh, but then we have to build some dam up through this side to stop it from going over. But um, see, you can't. Okay, let's delete that. Delete that one. Yes. Okay, it's still too far. Right, so what we might try and do, I might just see if, because sometimes more stupid things have happened, I'll do that and see if that helps. You might be surprised. Anyway, we'll see. Right, this one here is almost built. Okay, excellent. Well, that's fine. So, uh, we've got over here. This has all been built around here. So, we've got all these. This has been built now, which is good. We've got plenty of lumber. It should be coming out now. The other problem, we're going to have to make sure we've got enough timber to uh, to keep that up and running. Uh, yeah, so this building is connected to district centre by paths. That is that little bit too far away. Dang, damn it. Right, so let's just delete them because they're not going to help us. Yes, and delete. I wonder if we put one in here, whether it's going to work. Probably not. Um, yeah. All right. I think what we might do is we might just... Well, those ones there are... Well, see, those guys there are going to pick up that stuff through there anyway so that should be okay yeah we'll just leave that I'll just see oh that's been built they built that okay uh, maybe if we put a uh, lumber guy in here instead because we know they've reached that point maybe that might help all right now, how are we going over here still no success with this I don't know why Okay. Um, there's no, it doesn't make any sense as to why we can't get there. And what we could do actually is I might, what might help it is if we remove, remove that. Yes, and I remove that temporarily. And then we put the district gate here, like so. Put the path in there. I wonder whether that's going to help it. Yes, there you go. So these guys here now have full access to it, so they'll just build that, won't be a problem. Excellent. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the levee up to there and to there, and that should finish. And then we can also probably delete all this here. Like that. Okay. All right, that should get us good for the next drought at least. All right, so this is a six day drought, is it? Or seven day drought? Right, we should still be okay though. Uh, where are we at with water? Water's still okay. We've still plenty of water through here. Yeah, we're okay. That's not even, f that's not full though. Um, why haven't they? Okay, all right, that's all right. That's, we can manage with that, that's okay. Um, we do need to get some of this stuff here built, particularly, um, these units here so that's been built i need to get so that needs to be a priority and that needs to be a priority okay oh and does that right so i'll put them on the priority list so for this district they'll be a priority but that won't impinge on the priority for this building over here okay now these guys over here are doing okay in fact, let's have a look at the status of them. Um, hunger, thirst, sleep, nutrition, one they've got. So they're okay. Uh, homeless and unemployed. Do I put a house in for them? 
They, they don't really need to have a house. It only affects their well-being. And I mean, they're not going to be here for long, so I don't think they're going to worry about a house. We'll just leave them. They can be homeless. I built a dam. They can sleep in the dam for, for crying out loud. There we go. Here's that. Come on. Now, what we're going to need to do, we have got unemployed now, so we're going to do the same over here. So let's get this started. Uh, I'm just going to pause it. Now we'll set up this district. So I'm going to have a drop-off point here, like so. I'm going to put in some water dumps. No, not water dumps. I'm going to put water tanks. Uh, I'm going to put in one, two, three, four water tanks in here. I will put in a log pile, like so, because we're going to need to bring some logs in here. Um, I'm going to leave that at that level for now. I'll leave this at this level for now. I'm not going to bother about bumping that up too much higher. I will do probably later on. But for the moment, we'll leave that where it is. I'm going to bring that across to there. There, to there, to there, to there. Okay. Uh, so we've got that. Now, um, Once we get water here though, that'll actually green up most of this area here as well. So I'm not going to put the water dump in to there as yet. What we're going to do now is we're going to set up our uh, roots. So we're going to go, we've got five. So we're going to add new root into there. We want berries. Yes. Add new root into there. We want carrot. Yes. Add new root into here. We want logs. We want planks. And lastly, we want water. And that's all 10 routes from the distribution post sorted. Okay. So again, we're going to let them build that up before I move any beavers over to there. So let's just let that happen initially. All right. What these guys got over here? They've got berries, carrots, planks, and water. They haven't got any logs at the moment. Uh, perhaps what we need to do then is give them access to this. So we will put in that and that, and then we'll tell them they can chop the trees down in here as well. And hopefully they'll access those. Right. Um, yep. Okay, good to go. Let's see if they do that. Yep, straight away they're going in to do that. Excellent, so I'll build that, go down there, and then uh, be good. All right, so the first level of the dam is done. So now what we're going to do is build this next level through here, and this will start banking up. So what I'm going to do here is these floodgates. Let's have a look at the floodgates. So we can synchronize them or have them not synchronized. And what I can do is I can change the level of the floodgates. See? So what that'll do is it'll change the level. So if I have it up here, it'll fill up. Oh, sorry, I'm going to go. let go. Oh, wrong button. All right, bring it back. Right, click there. It's up to the height. So it'll actually restrict the water all the way up. It won't let any water over until it gets to this height here. So three quarters of the way up this, this levee bank here. Uh, or I can drop it all the way back down. Okay, and let water flow. And initially, that's what we're going to do. We're going to let the water flow. We'll bank a bit of it up through here, um, which is fine. We, we can deal with that. The other thing is too, it'll also probably fill in a bit of this as well, which will help make this a bit green temporarily but uh that's okay what are we missing we're missing logs we're waiting on some log deliveries okay let's uh let's come over here we can add another two people into here two beavers to help prioritizing that uh these guys may have been dropping off stuff over here which they have berries carrots logs and water excellent we need delivery in here is what we need we need logs Come on, guys, we need some logs. Right, going through the night again. Uh, three days to go. Will we make it through? Of course we will. Oh, hang on. Oh, no, we might not. Oh, that's not, no. Oh, phew. No. Oh, silly duck. That's that district. <laughs> the primary district, we've got 500, 600 litres of water, so we're okay. Uh, this one here is not pumping water, so we can pause him for the moment. As you can see, this is the problem we're going to have. So it dries us out very quickly because we're pumping all the water out of here. Um, that's necessary. It's also what we need. So that's why we need to bank up a supply of water here. 
uh, to assist us. Right, have we got any logs? Still no logs. Because we've got no logs. Why have we got no logs? Right, are we chopping all these trees down that we should be? Uh, not chopping these trees down. Why aren't we chopping them down? Right, Let's fix that. All these, chop them down. Come on, get in there, chop them down. Oh, those ones there, the maples. Chop them down too. Right. Now, I just wonder if it's because we haven't got a um, chopper in there. Uh, what I can do is I can put a chopper in there like that, and that'll help with those. Okay. That should be doing all those. Should be fine. All right. Okay, in tonight again. Two days to go. Uh, still got plenty of water, which is fine. Our farms over here are still functioning, which is important. And we still haven't got any logs over here. And we haven't got any extra water, but water we got stowed up in here. So we're okay. We're okay. We don't have to panic. Not yet. <clears throat> All right. So, um, he's sleeping. Good boy. Oh, where's my deliveries? Come on. I want some deliveries over here, guys. You're only going to the other district. I need, I need this district done as well. Come on. I need some logs. Oh, there's plenty of logs. Where'd they all come from? Where did they all come from? That was all of a sudden. Um, I don't know. Anyway, uh, we've got a mass supply of logs all of a sudden. 545 of them. Right, I'm going to put some of you guys in here because I've got 45 unused beavers at the moment. We got over here. Still no logs. Come on. Get me some logs. Crying out loud. Seriously? Uh, put this in here. Like that. Can't reach over there. Yeah, we will. So I'm just going to grab these logs here because we're going to need everything we can get. I'll go over there. They'll grab those ones. Right, do got no logs. Where, why don't they bring anything over here? Okay, this is bizarre. Why haven't we got anything running over there? Right, there's no problem with the root, seemingly. I don't know why it's not distributing those. There's plenty of logs in here. Um, don't know. I really don't know. It's got me puzzled, actually. I don't know why we're not seeing logs unless they're all being used over here. And that's why we're not seeing them over here as yet. Right, what have we got over here? Let's see. Can we start this up? We've got logs. We've got water. Uh, I haven't got any planks. Okay, so once we finish the drought, we'll start producing some more planks. Um... We have another day and we'll start production there. At that point, once we start production over here, uh, over here again, we got some planks being developed. Look, we got nine nine logs again. Where have all the logs gone? Hopefully, they've gone over here this time. No. Where have all the logs gone? You're supposed to be delivering logs. Man, there's twelve logs over here. There's no logs over here. Where are all the logs going? What am I building that's using logs? Other than planks, but the planks aren't running. So where are all my logs? That's too far away. Okay. To be expected. Delete. Yes. Right, and there you go. So we've now hit... So the drought has really hit us, right? So we've got no water supply whatsoever through here. We've only got this little piece over here. And that's why we want to get explosives so we can blow this apart and make this deeper. Um, but anyway, we've, we've just got to go through the night and then we'll get some more water coming in tomorrow. Okay. Come on, let's go. Oh, I paused it. What did I pause it for? Oh, bring me, bring me the water. Bring it down, Jerry. You'll see it come through as those trees and all that over there start to green up. And then we're dropping, the water's dropping pretty quick. 
Well, I don't care about my Asus. Go away. There you go. Right. Come on, where's the water? Come on, get through the day. Come on. Come on, 361 water. We can do it. We can survive. Had a few die of old age, but that's okay. We've got lodge capacity of 138. We've got 147, but that means we've got some of the other district. Here we go. Come on, water. Wait until we see those trees start. There we go. Starting to green. Here we go. It's coming down. Come on. Now, this is going to hold a bit of water back. Which is good for up here. It'll keep all this wet. But it's not going to be too much good for us. What I should really do, and I might pull that out. Um, in fact, I'm going to pull that out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull that out. And that out. What we're going to do is we're going to put in triple floodgate. And that will be the perfect size for that. Okay. So, unfortunately, we put the wrong ones in, but we're going to pull them out. Yep. And yep. And I'm going to put the right ones in there now. Okay. Right. Now. Uh, oh, all these trees here aren't being... Okay. See, I always forget to put that in. Now, will they go get that? They might go get some of it. I hope they will. Come on, guys. Come, come top these trees down. It'd be really nice if you did. I don't think they are. But anyway, should do, though. They're, yeah, should do. Object flag. There he goes. Excellent. So we're going to get some wood, finally. They're going to get their own wood. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to help these guys out and put another one of those in. Yeah, like that, because we need the wood. We really need the wood. Berries and carrots. We've got no water delivery and we've got no... Um, what's the name? No... Um, well, we just got delivery then. We've got one plank and one log. Eleven water. Right. Thanks for your business, guys. Really appreciate it. Right. What do you guys got over here? 21 logs, no planks. What do we need for those? Just logs. You know what? Let's get them over there and get them started. So I'm going to transfer my great uh, 10 to District 2. That one there. I'm going to do 10 adults. My great. Still dropping off stuff. Well, they dropped off now. More logs. Here they are. They're, they're all arriving. Grabbing some food and water and some logs. And they're going to go build. We want to get this built. Right, you guys are going to go to there, like that. Excellent. Uh, I'm going to go... Is it worth putting a builder's shed in? Oh, it's going to take planks. I don't want to do that. Okay, but anyway, they're, they're away. They're doing that. Hopefully these guys will be coming in here and they'll build this soon. Uh, logs. We just need planks. So it's just planks that are holding us up now. Right. Oh, excellent. That's been built. So that's another gears production there going in, which is fine. Now, uh, what we could do... We can delete that. Yes. I'm going to put this in here now. I'm going to set this up. We're going to put that there and that all the way down there and the reason I'm going to do that is you'll see in a second I'm going to delete that yes T-junction like that that becomes a priority build it Come on, three logs get it built this one is definitely doing no good to me whatsoever what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete him. Yes. I'm going to... Right, we're going to help the water here. I'm going to put these in there like that. Like that. 
Uh, I'm going to put a stairway in there just for the sake of it because we might want to get on top of that sometime later. Like that. I'm going to delete our path. Like that, yes. And I'm going to put in some more turbines. One, two, three, four. And then actually what we're going to need here is that's going to be delete. Yes. Uh, I'm going to put a staircase in here. Staircase. There like that. I'm going to put these in there like that. Okay. Right. Then what we're going to do is we're going to link all these up. So we're going to put, for instance, in fact, what I'm going to do, just to make sure I can get into here, uh, do, 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 remove those bushes there like that. I'm then going to put all this in and then they can build around it so that'll be fine. Like that. Like that. Like that. And then we're going to put these two in here. Right, so now, once we finish in here, we can, this will be fine. So what we can do now is I can delete, uh, delete that. Yes. And I can put in, I'm going to put one more lumber in. One more lumber mill. That's all the lumber mills. So I'm going to have eight lumber mills, four gear mills, and that's it. Done. You see they built this up. And what this will also do here, this will just mean that the water will flow a little bit better through here. Um, but we'll have these six cogs will actually be driving our power through here. So it'll give us more output. Okay, these guys down here, they're running into here, which is great now. So we've got that built up to two levels. Uh, these, are, these are coming along. Excellent. Right, so they've, they've started delivering to us again. Nice. So we've only got little stuff at the moment. That's okay. That's okay. It's better than nothing. We'll take that. Right, how are we going over here? Uh, we've got two blocks built. Good. Okay, what we can do while we're over here, because we've got some guys doing nothing, is I'm going to put uh, this down here like this. And we're going to start collecting uh, some metal. So, yes, we're going to research that. And we're going to put two of these in. One, two. In fact, I'll put three in. Why not? Okay, there we go. And I'm going to put a storage in here. Just a small storage. Like that. Okay, berries, carrots, water. We've got plenty of water in there for the moment. Okay. Uh, logs. Logs. I'm going to make that a priority. I want to store some water in there. Okay. Things are moving. Literally. All right. Well, this has been built now, which is good. All this platforming, so we can build further out here. We can also, what we can do, actually, we can put some windmills in here temporarily. Um, that's going in. Nice. Happy with that. What's wrong with you? Beaver is stranded. Okay. Well, we don't want you to be stranded. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a staircase uh, up there. And we'll make that a priority. And we'll make that a priority. Oh, he died. Why'd he die? Hmm. Died of hunger. I didn't get back and get any food. Okay. Oh, food is a problem. Look at the food. Okay. Food is a big problem. Um... Okay, what's our quick remedy going to be for that? I don't think there is a quick remedy. Um, stop sending them over the districts with food. Uh, 4431 there. Oh, hang on. Distribution limits. Uh, berries. 30. And carrot. 30. 15. 15. Okay. All right, let's see. Um, prioritize these to haul as well, because we want to get that out as quick as we can. 22 unemployed. Um, all right, what else we got going on? How much potato have we got stored up? 
not much. Got plenty of wheat, so we really need to get the grist mills and that running now, uh, which is um, over here. I need some gears, so let's prioritize that. That is prioritized, uh, and we'll prioritize him as well. Okay. All right, I'll leave that all going over there. That's happening through there, okay. All right, they should be collecting some metal now. Over here, we should have some metal. We got 36 metal, all right? Um, we need logs. Logs is a problem. Have we got planks over here yet? Uh, no planks. Okay. I've got planks coming in. Pretty sure I set planks up, didn't I? We haven't got any planks really to send over, so that's why they're not sending over at the moment. But our District 3 planks, District 2 planks. Okay, so we should be making plenty of planks. Um, but they're being used up in here, obviously. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to pause. I'm going to keep you going. I'm going to pause you and you and you and you. So it's not taking unnecessary logs and planks and that into there. We do want these two running so I can at least start getting the wheat being used and then putting in some uh, bakeries. Now the bakeries, can I put the bakeries in now? I can, but where can I put them? I can put them in here. I'll put a couple of them in here. Two at least. Uh, I'll put one there or one there and I'll put another one in there like that. We'll put a path in. There we go. Right. Logs, planks and gears. Again, I'm going to pause those because up they're not important until we've got this running. Because we need to make the, we need to crush the wheat into flour before we can do anything else. Oh, look at this. Excellent. Right. Excellent. This is building up. Right. So what we need to do though now though is I'm just going to drop that down to one and drop that one down to one because I don't want to build up too far in here yet because we're not built in here. All right. And once this is built, once I finish building this, then all this I'm just going to, I'm just going to take the, um, the beavers away and uh, leave it here. Just the infrastructure will stay there for in case we need it later on. All right. Because if we want to... What we have to do as well is if we want to transfer goods from this district to our primary district, we've got to put in another one of these um, distribution posts. Okay, and then we've got to have people, uh, beavers to man it. Uh, so it becomes a bit of a problem. So um, we're not going to do that as yet. Okay, where are we at time-wise? It's time, oh, geez, time flies, right. So let's just see where we're going to go. We, it's time to sign off, basically. We've got plenty of water there. They're building that. As a priority, that should be built very soon. We need planks. Uh, right, so we have, what have we got in here? Globally, we've got no planks. Yes, we've got one plank, two planks. They're being used as quick as we produce them, which I'd expect. Right. Um, they're all busting for level three food. What I should probably also look at doing is giving them some entertainment and all that sort of stuff. So down here in leisure, uh, we've got the campfire, which we've given them. We've given them a rooftop terrace. I think we should give them a temple as well. Um, satisfies their spirituality, apparently. I just got nowhere to put it here for the moment, um, which is another problem. What I could do is I could build out here, but I don't want to because I want to blow all this up. And if I build anything out here, I've got to take it off to blow it up. All right, water is low as well. Why is our water so low? Hmm. Things aren't quite going smoothly because our water is very low. I don't know why our water is so low. Okay. What we're going to do is I'm going to pull all you guys back. Migrate population, District 1. What have we got? 9. Migrate. Okay, I'm going to put a pause on that. Okay, so they'll stop delivering over there, hopefully. Bring them back over into here. 
uh, then hopefully they can assist in getting those deliveries done. I think we need to put another hauling post in, to be honest. Um, that may assist us a little bit more. Uh, hauling post. Where can we fit a hauling post? Let's put one down here, actually. One down here. And that'll we can, that should assist these guys here in getting rid of their water. Uh, water's built back up a little bit more, which is good. We've got plenty of timber, which is excellent. That's what we want to see. All right, so things now are progressing a little bit better again. This guy here, he's going to be excellent. He's finished now. So that's it. We've got our eight lumber yards running. Uh, building lacks power. Why you lack power? Oh, is that because we're dammed up now? It is. Right, so that's that's the reason why it's lacking power, because it's dammed up. So as you can see, the water... Oh, so now the water's coming through here. So what we're going to do... And grab this, I am going to synchronize the height, drop it by half. And that means that the water is going to flow through here. We have filled this up though, and look at the difference that's made. So now all this is green. Okay. Um, so that's good, but we just don't want this water to aggress all the way through here and affect everything over here. Um, all right, so what we might do, uh, let's open that back up now and just see. See what happens. Be interested to see. Oh, we've flooded here. Right. Come on, let that water go. Uh, why aren't you flowing out? Oh, you ran out. Okay. All right. That'll see. This is the problem. We don't want to have this flooding. Okay. Because as soon as you flood, we can't use any of the buildings. Why are you flooding still? Right. Maybe. We need to work on this a bit and um, maybe a bit problematic because we've going over. Dum, 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 dum. We may have to pull this apart a little bit. Anyway, that's okay. We'll, if we have to do that, we have to do it. Uh, okay, or what we do is we just bring that back up to there and let that deal with that. We're going to have to get that built. Uh, what have we got over there? We've got some logs over there now. I'm going to put a pause on this one. What we're going to do is I'm going to migrate the population from here to District 2 of 9. So I'll migrate them across and I know I'm well and truly over time and I've got to finish up. So, right, we'll leave it there and we'll come back on the next game day. Oh, see, here we go. We're, we've got a problem. Houston, we have a huge problem. All right. Uh, drop it back down to zero. Just let the water flow. It'll it'll fix itself up eventually. It's going to flood initially. All right. Uh, we're just going to deal with that. So we'll, we'll deal with that off camera. And then when we come back in the next episode, hopefully we've dealt with all this flood. Oh, no. What have we done? Oh, no. All right. Anyway, that's where we're going to leave it. <laughs> Don't forget, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing. Press that alarm notification icon as well so you're made aware when more disastrous videos like this are made available on the channel. Don't forget to join us on Twitch, Twitter, Discord, and Facebook details down below. And, of course, take care of yourselves and loved ones. And we'll see you again very, very soon back here at Timberborn, the flooded adventure, and Ducks All Gaming. See you all later. Bye.